Hi there, I'm Darren Williams from FandangleProductions.com and this video will show you how to create extra normal animations. Now you're probably wondering what are extra normal animations. Okay, so I'll take you to my YouTube channel, Fandangle Productions, and I've created some extra normal animations. So here's an example of an animation that I've done. Uh, the, it gives you an example of what the quality is like and what you can do. So to be able to make these animations we need to go to the Extra Normal website and you can find that on www.extranormal.com Now it's free, it doesn't cost you anything. All you need to do is register set up a username and then you can start making movies. So to make a movie you need to click make movies. It's quite simple. And we're taken to this page where we have a choice of scenes and characters. There's quite a few scenes that we can choose from. And my choice is superheroes. You can select either one actor or two actors. With two actors you can have two characters talking together or just the one actor. In this case I'll just have the one actor. And this will take you to the animation editing page. And as it loads here we have a selection of tools. Uh, we got cameras, we got animations, which is actions uh, that the characters make, uh, expressions, where the character looks, where the character points, pauses, and sound effects. This is the default, and I don't want this character. I'll show you how to change that character. Also, on this side here, we have the preview of the animation that we do. We can play it, go back to the beginning, and also you can alter the sound there. Okay, so we've got this character here, and I want to change that character to Captain Broccoli. The way we do that is we scroll down the bottom. Here we can change our scene. Now you've got a gold dollar, that means you have to pay for it. If it's got a green dollar with a stroke, it's free. Now this is the scene that I want, and it's default for this scene and character. Okay, now I want to change the character. So click here, and we have a choice of characters. Once again, gold dollar, you have to pay for them. Green is free and there's Captain Broccoli and he's been placed in the scene. Also we need to give him a voice. I live in Australia so I'll choose the Australian English male voice. You can play it if you want to hear the sound uh, but we'll just apply. Now we go back to the animation editing page. In here you can type Hi there, kids. Okay, now I've created some text. I've got a text on Notepad. Just copy and paste. There it is. There's my text. Now I want a camera scene. So it's a camera. Double click that. And you notice you have a, box, a picture here that give, lets you know what each camera angle is. Going through these camera angles, looking for the right one. I like number seven, so I click apply, and here we are, it's been inserted here. And also here, I want Captain Broccoli to cross his arms, so double click expressions, animations, crossed arms. Another thing here, when you select the animation, you can click the play button have an idea of what the character will do. So in this case I want crossed arms. Superhero crossing his arms. 
click apply and there is the animation insert there and you can do the same with all of these options here you can insert at different points where you want these options to be uh, put in the animation okay next thing we do we want to preview if you press publish that means you've finished editing you don't want to make any more changes it's your final cut and you want to publish it on YouTube uh, but before that we want to continue editing so we click the preview button and what this does is we're told here generating preview you may continue to make changes while your preview renders okay now this is being rendered online on the actual normal website so we have to wait until that's rendered and as, as you can see it's quite it's very simple to use just a matter of typing text whatever your dialogue is if you have two characters and you click this you get another dialogue box and you can change the character in that box okay so there's our animation it's a low resolution picture and that's because we're communicating with the actual normal website and it's just cutting down on bandwidth so here we go okay so that's the animation and it's very easy to do, it's free and it's fun Okay, I hope you enjoyed this tutorial how to create extra normal animations. Go and visit my website, fanangleproductions.com, and I'll produce another video that will show you how to uh, create a scene with two characters. So, until then, have a good day.